Uh, what's going on everyone today's the 15th of september 2023 here real quick to give you all an update price analysis for you guessed it v chain so let's go ahead and break this video down real quick about what we suspect the price is about to do next in v chain so now take a look at the chart you guys can see it i was predicting that the market in v chain was going to go higher back on september the 11th 2023 you guys can see that i identified this downtrend line in the market for v chain at that moment in time and the market actually broke outside of that downtrend line maybe for a day or two and then quickly came right back down below you guys can see that this was your indication that the market here in VeChain is definitely weak you got the indicators triggered right there you guys can see a, a fake as well as a push to go down bar all on one price bar that is the reason why the market in VeChain completely ran down following this day september the 15th i mean september august the 15th 2023 so maybe a day or so we you guys can see that we were in a profitable position right there three and three quarters of a percent on the high of august 14th outside of that the market of each chain definitely has collapsed our area of support was right there around 0 0.017 in the chain the market actually completely cratered below that support area and now you guys can see check this out let me go ahead and read this price prediction here look at this what's going on to the market now in v chain why is the volume increasing all of a sudden in the market of each chain over the last four trading days? If you look to the left of the chart, it will actually tell you why the market of each chain is going up. Have you done that? Look at this. Is that by coincidence that the market of each chain currently is going higher now? Take a look. We've been here before. Even when the market initially created below our support area on August the 15th and the 16th. Look. It came and bounced off of this area. One and a half cents. Just like it did back in mid-June. So this is not a coincidence. Those buyers who bought in June, as well as on this day, August the 17th, they came and bought again on September the 12th. Just that simple. So this is the actual trading range. That we're currently getting into the market in v chain a very wide trading channel now is the market still bullish yes it is look what happened on the last two days with that massive amount of volume we, we need to anticipate that the price in v chain is still bullish the problem is okay how high do you think the price is going to go because we're currently hitting this area of resistance right here to where the market initially acted as support in v chain so what's the probability of price breaking above that line because if that's going to be the case if it's going to do it then we need to look forward and try to anticipate the next area which will be here so it's not that far this will have to be our next area for us to contend to see some more selling okay so that's actually probable that we can see the market of each chain run to that particular price target 0 0.017 I mean, we have 13 hours and 24 minutes left on this current today price bar, and it still looks pretty healthy. I do like the three day time frame as well. Volume is massive. We're definitely seeing some increased pricing activity into the market in VeChain over the last six days. Here it is on the five day chart. Again, it looks pretty bullish right now. I just want everyone to be cautious as to how high price is going to go. The weekly chart looks good as well, too. Just need to be careful at this price level right here. Okay, so I'm just going to give it to you straight. I am going to anticipate price in VeChain just like I did on my last price prediction to go higher. But look at this level right there, 0.017. It's going to be a massive problem for the buyers. Okay. So let me go ahead and put this on the daily time frame. And we're going to anticipate the market in VeChain going up. Okay. So my targets are not going to be too big. Uh, because I definitely want us to get more confirmation that the buyers are going to move this price up. My first target is going to be right here around 0 0.0176. My second target is going to be around 0 0.017. I mean 0 0.018. Okay, so like I said, the first one is going to be here. 0 0.0176, which is 2.86%. Next one is going to be around 0 0.018, which is around 45 and then my third target is going to be around like 0 0.0185. Well, let me bring it up here 
to 0 0.0188. That would be my third target there. Okay. So put this back on the daily time frame because this is where we're going to view the price action from. And that is it. I'm going to get rid of. Well, I'm going to lift this resistance area and I'll keep it right there where I had it. And that's it. I'm done. Today's your first time ever seeing my videos and my content. And you all appreciate how simple it is to predict prices and see where prices are likely to go. I want you all to join me. Hit that like button. Share the video and also subscribe. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.